Okay, so in this video, we're going to talk about building your OneNote master class notebook. Um, the idea behind the master class notebook is that it gives you a space to build curriculum, store resources, maybe research content before you actually pass that along to your students. Um, so there's two real ways that you can get to setting this up. If you go on the web, you can click and go to office.com and then click on the class notebook and it'll run you through the steps. I also wanted to show you that in the OneNote app, if you will go to class notebook and then go over here to the little icon that looks like a notebook, you can see it says create class notebook and that will get you to the setup. Okay, so here we're just going to call it um, whatever your master class will be. I'll just say master OneNote resources. And we'll do next. Here, this really is talking about the um, class notebook and how you work with your students. This video is more for designing a master class notebook, so we're just going to disregard that information for right now. In this step, you have the option of sharing your content with another teacher. So if you and another teacher are collaborating on a class, then maybe you want to share that information between the two of you. So you can give permission to another teacher here. Um, if you have someone in mind, then just type their name um, and add it. The next step, again, this is a class notebook. So you, since we're talking about the master class, you're not going to have students. So you're just going to hit next. Here, I always remove all these default sections, um, and when we go through the video of setting up the class notebooks, then we'll talk more about that, but just go ahead and remove those. Okay, and then here it gives us the overview of what the teacher notebook is going to look like in the student. Um, and so for our master, we're just going to click Create. Okay, once it has finished um, its process, then it brings us here and it's created. Um, we don't need to worry about downloading the class notebook add-in. What we are interested in is opening it in OneNote. So right here, we're going to click on open in OneNote. And we should see that notebook added to our notebooks that we already have in the OneNote app loaded and has everything set up. It comes default with some information in these sections. And so like for for example with the welcome, it's just giving you standard information about OneNote and um, I like to just go ahead and delete the section after I'm finished with that information to just kind of get it out of my way. And I do the same thing for this page called using the collaboration space and the same thing for using the content library. After you have an understanding of that content, you can just delete it. And now that your master notebook is set up, you're ready to add content. 